How you can get seven times more done in one day than 96% of people get done in one week. And no, I'm not joking. Most people fuck around. Most people don't actually work. Most people are sitting on their phones. They're checking emails. They're getting distracted. They're multitasking. They're doing low impact tasks and they're searching for the next distraction. So it's not actually hard to get more done in one day than most people get done in a week. All it takes is a bit of focus, a bit of prioritization, a bit of discipline, and a few sprinkles of effort. However, it actually starts the night before. You need to be getting seven to nine hours sleep and you need to plan for tomorrow because realistically, you need to make sure that you're mentally rested. Otherwise, your cognitive capabilities are going to be limited. Basically, you want to make sure that you're ready to dominate the day and that you're on top form. So you need sleep. And you also want to know what you're doing and when you're doing it. Because if you wake up and you don't know what you're doing or when you're doing it, you're already wasting time and you're not going to get more done than most people. Now, I'm actually going to let you in on a little trade secret that the productivity gurus do not tell you about getting more done. You need to listen to music, but not just any music, not just your top of the charts music with words because you have evolved and you have been conditioned to focus on words. So you're listening to music with words. It's going to distract you and take your focus. However, you should listen to music without words. So instrumental music, whether that's the likes of binaural beats or it's the likes of Hans Zimmer. Hans Zimmer is the goat. If you put on some Hans Zimmer when you're working, you're really going to feel like you're taking over the world and you will go into the deepest state of flow and you will get so much shit done. It is a genuine life hack. Now, the main reason that most people don't actually get a lot done in their week is because they're prioritizing shallow work over deep work. Essentially, they're spending more time doing pointless tasks like checking emails than the actual lever moving tasks. So if you want to get more done in one day than most people get done in a week, you need to prioritize deep work over shallow work. So instead of doing pointless tasks like checking emails and admin work, you want to be doing cognitively demanding value per producing tasks, the lever moving tasks that are actually going to move you towards your goals. Now, what these tasks are, I obviously can't tell you because that's going to be specific to you and your goals. But these are the tasks that will actually help you make progress and move towards your goals. And yes, these tasks are hard. That is why they produce value and that is why you need to be doing them and prioritizing them. Now, with that said, you can't be doing two or three lever moving tasks at once. Each work block that you do needs to have one lever moving task. Essentially, if you think of focus like a laser, if you have a really highly focused laser that goes into one point, it will burn away that point, okay? It will make progress. If you disperse the laser over a wider area on multiple items, it's not going to burn through the items because it's less powerful because it's less focused. Your focus is the same when it comes to tasks. If you put all your focus into one task, you will get better work done and you will get more work done in less time. But if you spread your focus out over multiple tasks, your work is going to be crap and it's going to take you forever to get through them. You need to get as focused as you can on one task so that you can get as much high quality work done as fast as possible. Now, if you complete that task in your deep work block, you can of course move on to the next lever moving task. But focus on one priority task each work block. And another reason for that is because when you are trying to do two tasks at once, you're not actually focusing on two tasks at once. What you're doing is, is you're switching your focus rapidly. You're moving your focus from one task to the next and back and forth really fast. And since it can actually take 15 to 30 minutes to become focused on a task and enter a flow state, you're never actually getting to produce your best work in either of those tasks. So you want to only focus on one task, but the same also goes for distractions. So each time you get distracted, let's Let's say a notification goes off on your phone, you're working, notification, your focus all of a sudden goes to the notification and it's going to take you 15 to 30 minutes to get refocused on your task. Hence, that's 15 to 30 minutes of wasted time and energy. So you need to remove distractions, especially your phone. No excuse. Whatever task you're going to do on your phone for work, you can do on your computer. So just get rid of your phone. No excuse and remove any other distractions you might have. So it can take 15 to 30 minutes to get focused onto a task, but your focus focus is also finite. There's only a certain amount of highly demanding cognitive effort that your brain can produce each day. And that number tends to be around four hours per day. So let's say you try to do five hours of deep work. After four hours of deep work, that last final hour, your brain's cognitive capabilities are going to be limited massively. And the quality of your work is going to suffer massively. Hence, you're actually hindering yourself and holding yourself back by pushing on that extra hour. So once you had four hours of deep work, Stop doing deep work. Stop doing your lever moving tasks. You're holding yourself back and you're just going to produce subpar work. However, that doesn't mean that you have to do nothing. After your four hours of deep work, 
you can go and start doing your shallow work tasks. So the tasks that don't move the needle, that don't actually help you move towards your goal, but they need done. So that's the likes of checking emails, social media DMs, admin tasks, all the stuff that needs done to help you do what you need to do, but doesn't actually move towards your goals and isn't actually cognitively demanding or hard. Now, like I said at the start of the video, most people spend their time scrolling social media. Most people are always distracted and actually looking for the next distraction. They multitask and they do low impact tasks. So if you can prepare the night before if you can listen to flow inducing music if you can prioritize deep work over shallow work and have one single task for each work block remove distractions and don't do any more than four hours of deep work per day you will get more done in one day than 96 percent of people get done in one week now my friends again thank you for watching as always all my paid and free resources are in the description below so if you're interested in any of them go check them out in the description below and as always again Thank you for watching. That is it for this video and I will see you in the next one.